Welcome to Calcutta Races Monsoon Meeting, 13th day, Wednesday, 18th September 2019, Race Preview. We move on to the first race, which is the Not Much Handicap. Force is in Class 5, to be run over a distance of 1,400 meters. Number 1 will be Lakshay. Lakshay's last outing was in race number 76, over 1,400 meters, where Lakshay finished on 6th after much efforts. And the winner of that race was Fan Coat, who came up with a late dash on the stand side and went on to win it by a head. Number two will be Porus. Porus is at one start this monsoon meeting in race number 19 over 1200 meters where Porus uh, finished almost detached, uh, finished seventh uh, and the winner of that race was uh, Aftershock who won it by a nose. Number three, we're looking at Gramercy Park. Win legend out of Manhattan Rain is Gramercy Park. Has had uh, two eye-catching runs. First one finished uh, fourth over 1,400 meters in race number 21. And uh, last start in race number 42 over 1,400 meters. Made it a pillar to post uh, uh, run, but uh, fell short by a nose. Uh, was overtaken on the outside by Beat the Bank, who won that race. And uh, Gramercy Park settled, by, uh, settled for second spot and lost it by a nose. Number four will be Winner's Delight. Winner's Delight's just had one start this monster meeting in race number 15 over 1100 meters where Winner's Delight uh, traveled seventh all the way and traveled very wide at the track in the final stage of the race and the winner of that race is Shimmering Star. Number five, we're looking at Shivai. Shiva has had two outings this monsoon meeting, finished off the board in both its outings, last one being in race number 70, where Shivai finished on eighth, and the winner of that race was Hurricane Storm. Number six will be Artis Royal. Artis Royal's last outing was uh, over 1100 meters in race number 40, where Artis Royal finished on uh, fourth uh, after much efforts, was traveling nine till it turned for home and gradually gained places, but couldn't match uh, strides with the winner and finished on fourth was Artis Royal, and the winner of that race was Dilmange Mo, who won that race by two and three quarter lengths. Number seven, we're looking at Federosa. One start this monster meeting in race number 35 over 1200 meters. Uh, practically no show there by Federosa. Finished on right at the back end to finish on ninth. And the winner of that race was Glorious Leaps. Number eight will be Havana Gray. Havana Gray's last outing was over a mile in race number 13, where Havana Gray uh, traveled uh, fourth till it turned firm and then gradually fell back and finished on seventh was Havana Gray, and the winner of that race was Constance. Number nine, we're looking at Looking Good. Looking Good's uh, last outing was in race number 62. That was its only outing over 1,400 meters, where Looking Good traveled third till it turned for home and then gradually dropped back uh, rapidly, I would say, and finished on 10th right at the back end to finish on 10th out of 10 runners. And the winner of that race was Fabiola. We move on to the second race, which will be the bold display handicap to be run over a distance of 1,400 meters. Uh, we're looking at number one, Reincarnation. Last outing was over 1,100 meters uh, in race number 63, uh, where Reincarnation traveled third till it turned for home and then gradually fell back and finished on fifth after much efforts. And the winner of that race is Dancing Prince, who won that by two and a half lengths.
Number two will be Dixie Diamond. Dixie Diamond's had two outings this month, so meaning finished on boat to finish on third in its first outing. A last outing over 1,800 metres, finished on sixth in race number 67. And the winner of that race was Bojangles, who won that by a shot neck. Number three, we're looking at Vice Admiral. Vice Admiral's had two outings this month, so meeting finished right at the back end in both its outings. Last one being over 1,400 metres in race number 57. You could see uh, Vice Admiral right at the back end, finished on 10th, and the winner of that race was Jay Wan. Number four, we are looking at Fantasia. Fantasia's last outing was in race number 77, over uh, 1,400 metres, where Fantasia finished on second uh, behind After Shock, who won that race by a length and a half. Quite an eye-catching run by Fantasia. Number five, we're looking at Shohin. Shohin's had two outings this month, meeting last one being over 1,200 metres and raced him at 49, where Shohin uh, finished on fifth after much efforts, and the winner of that race was Aquitania, who went on to win it by two and a three-quarter lands. Number six, we're looking at Big Star. Big Star's last outing was over 1,200 metres this month's meeting in race number 74, where Big Star travelled very wide in the final stage of the race and finished on sixth. And the winner of that race was Novikov, who was too good that day, won it by a length and a three quarters. Number seven will be Pancho Villa. Pancho Villa's had two outings this month, so meaning finished off the boat in both its outings, last outing being over 1,800 metres in race number 39, where Pancho Villa finished on fifth, and the winner of that race was Seven Step, who won that race by a three and a quarter lengths, won it impressively, was Seven Step. Number eight will be Adirith. Arazana de Miami is Adirit. they uh, just had one start this uh, season in race number 56 over 1200 meters and quite an eye catcher that was by Adirit uh, finished on second, uh, traveled all the way second in fact and finished four and a quarter lengths behind the winner that was Shimmering Star and that's uh, what you need to watch out for today is Adirit. We move on to the third race, which is the Grey Wing Split for Maiden Horses, three years old, only rated 21 to 46 to be run over a distance of 1,200 meters. Number one will be Manzoni. Manzoni's last outing was in the Bangalore season in race number 139 over 1,600 meters, where Manzoni finished on seventh, and the winner of that race was Speaking of Stars. Number two will be Botswana Star. Botswana Star's last outing was over a mile in this uh, monsoon meeting in race number 55, where Botswana Star finished on seventh after much efforts, and the winner of that race was Inca, who came up with a strong run down in the center and went on to win it by a length and a three quarters. Number three will be Miami. Win legend out of Florida. Is at three starts this month's so meeting. Last start was not impressive over 1,100 meters in race number 50, where after much efforts, Miami finished on seventh, and the winner of that race was Adira, who won it by a length and three quarters. Number four will be Rush for Gold. Rush for Gold's last outing was in the Calcutta winter season in race number 206 over 1100 meters, where Rush for Gold travelled fifth till it turned firm and then gradually faded back and finished right at the back end to finish 11th out of 14 runners. And the winner of that race was Astoria, who won it hands down by two and a half lengths. Number five will be Popcorn. 
Popcorn's last start was uh, quite impressive in race number 64 over 1200 meters where Popcorn traveled fourth till it turned for home and then gradually gained one place and finished on third towards the stand side was Popcorn and uh, also in the same race we had number seven Luna Lucinda who finished one behind to finish on fourth and the winner of that race was uh, Hukumat. Number six will be Davina Donatella. Davina Donatella's last outing was in race number 56 over 1200 meters, where Davina Donatella finished on fourth, and the winner of that race is Shimmering Star. We move on to the fourth race, which is the Rockefeller Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,200 meters. We're looking at number one, Novikov, holding court out of Dancer's Fan. Last outing was impressive in race number 74, this monsoon meeting over 1,200 meters, when Novikov came up with a very strong run down in the center and went on to win that race by a length of three quarters by beating Cup in Octem. Also in the same race, we had number five, Bergamot. Quite an eye-catching fourth that was by Bergamot. Number two will be Coup de Gras. Coup de Gras's last outing was in the winter season in race number 202 over a mile, where Coup de Gras finished on eighth after much efforts, and the winner of that race was Pothus, who came up at a late dash and won that race by three quarters of a length. Number three will be Pugnacious. Pugnacious' last outing was in the Monsoon meeting in race number 67 over 1800 meters with Pugnacious finished on ninth, and the winner of that race was Bojangles who won it by a short neck. Number four will be Aquitania. Aquitania's last outing was very impressive in race number 49. This monster meeting over 1,200 meters where Aquitania traveled second till it turned foam and then gradually came down in the center and took over the running and went on to win it by two and a three quarter lengths by beating Samaril. Also in the same race, we had number 10, Ruby Cube, who finished right at the back end to finish on 10. Number six will be Airlift. Airlift's last outing was at uh, this monsoon meeting in race number 77 over 1400 meters, where Airlift finished on sixth, and the winner of that race was Aftershock, who won it by a length and a half. Number seven will be Mr. Foggs. Mr. Foggs' last outing was this season in race number 63 over 1100 meters where Mr. Foggs finished on seventh. And also in the same race, we had number eight, Millennium Glory, that was on the stand side, finished on fourth. And the winner of that race was Dancing Prince. Number nine will be Tough Enough. Tough Enough's last outing was quite an eye catcher in race number 57 over 1400 meters, where Tough Enough traveled eighth uh, right at the back end till it turned firm and then gradually gained places towards the stand side and finished an eye catching fourth was Tough Enough, and the winner of that race was Jay Wan. We move on to the fifth race, which would be the Alternator Cup Force is four years old and over to be run over a distance of 1800 meters. Number one, we're looking at who makes the rules. Last outing uh, was in the Pune season in race number 25 over 2000 meters where uh, who makes the rules finished on sixth but uh, ran in Calcutta in the Calcutta winter season in race number 113 over 2000 meters where who makes the rules came up with a rattle and went on to win it by a short head by beating Kangra. Number two will be Breeze of the South. Breeze of the South's last outing was this monsoon meeting in race number 73 over 1200 meters, where Breeze of the South uh, finished on fifth, and the winner of that race was Eastern Star, who won that race by three quarters of a length.
Number three will be Cadman. Just one start this monsoon meeting in race number 24 over 1400 meters, where Cadman finished right at the back end to finish on eighth. Also in the same race, we had uh, number four, Shivalik Shahs, who finished two ahead to finish on sixth. And the winner of that race was Multitude, the big hearted Multitude, who won it again by a length and a quarter. Number six, we're looking at Lord of the Sea. One start this monster meeting in race number 59 over 1400 meters where Lord of the Sea finished on sixth after much efforts, traveled very wide in the final stage of the race. Also in the same race, we had number seven, Multi Glory, who finished on one ahead to finish on fifth. And the winner of that race was Hartnell, who won it by a long neck. We move on to the sixth race, which is the Adriana Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,800 meters. Number one will be Midnight Phantom. Midnight Phantom's last outing was in race number 58 this season, over 1,800 meters. The Midnight Phantom finished on fifth, and the winner of that race was Cold Frontier. Also in the same race, we had number four, Smith & Wesson, who finished an eye-catching second, just a length behind the winner. Number two will be Rule Down Under. Rule Down Under's last outing was uh, in race number 69. This monster meeting over 1,600 meters where Rule Down Under traveled third till it turned film and then gradually fell back one place and finished on fourth. Also in the same race, we had number three, Rufus, who finished one behind to finish on fifth. And number five, Sniper, who finished on both to finish on third. But the eventual winner of that race was Arjuna, who won it well by a length and a quarter. We move on to the seventh and last race, which will be the Whiplash Handicap to be run over a distance of 1,800 meters. We're looking at number one, Ruck Sharky. Ruck Sharky's last outing was over 1,800 meters in race number 67, where Ruck Sharky, after much efforts, finished on eighth. And the winner of that race was Bojangles, who got that by a short neck. Number two will be Duchamp. Duchamp's last outing was in race number 68 over a mile, where Duchamp finished on a faraway sixth. And also in the same race, we had number five, Yuvan, who was the eventual winner, who won that race by start to finish, and won it by two lengths. Also in the same race, we had number seven, that is Rustler, who finished uh, two behind. In fact, uh, finished on second was Rustler, two lengths behind the winner, that was Yuvan. Number three will be Expensive Affair. Expensive Affair has been knocking on the doors, had three starts, finished fifth in its first start, fourth in its second start, and third in its last start over 2,000 meters in race number 61. Also in the same race, we had number four, Rishank, who finished one ahead to finish on second in that race, and number eight, Cool Conqueror, who finished on fourth, but the winner of that race was Descartes, who was too good that day, won it by two lengths. Number six will be Averberry. Averberry's last outing was in race number 55 over a mile, where Averberry, uh, it was, uh, who led the field all the way, it fell unlucky. Uh, Averberry just got beat by Inca, who came up with a strong run down in the center and went on to win, uh, win it by uh, beating Averberry by a length and a three quarters. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for your time and hope to see you at the races tomorrow afternoon.